Blinky, wiggy, sleepyhead. I don't think you want to be there. Anybody there? Uh, apart from that bird. Hey! Looks like you're on your own, kid. <laughs> well, uh, this is a bit of a predicament. <clears throat> right. It looks like we have to go to that location. Now, this area is a bit important. Not right now, mind you, but later on in the game, well, much, much later, this area will become massively important. But not right now, unfortunately. We'll have to wait on that. So before we go any further, let us have a look around, because if there's one thing I've learned with Final Fantasy games, always look around for loot and gear. You never know what you're going to find. Heck, I remember one time in one of the Final Fantasy games, I took a little wonder and found a, like, a bloody good sword. Kept us going for half a game. Okay, what's up here? What's this? Something's written here. Idra duk bafrad parankda umaga ebusi dirakar hakra. Pardon if I butcher that language, but yeah, that's what it says. I'm trying my best. Okay, sorry about that. I am butchering the damn language here. What do we have here? Nothing. Oh, you're not read it. <laughs> yeah. Now, that language will come effect later, and if I have butchered the horrendous language there, I do apologize. But hey, I'm willing to give it a try. I mean, come on. When me and Spin the one in Japan a while ago, try reading the book, you know, how to speak Japanese was hard because, I mean, Spin did that much because he, he was into trying, you know, understand the language and, gee, God, that was hard. I mean, I understood broken Japanese, which is, which is basically, you know, you get, they, like, there's certain words you would understand, you know, for a period of time when you, you know, when you're immersed in their culture for a while. Right. Let's save up. Now, I will, I'll just re... Override that, because, you know, I'm already here. Done. But, um, yeah, when me and Spinder went to Japan, I mean, Spinder used a book to try and, you know, get into the whole language thing. And, I'll be honest, guys, it was very, very hard. Uh, and me and Spinder both agreed that we might have ended up Butchering the damn language badly. And I mean we tried. I mean the I mean the local Japanese you know, I think they were you know, shows a bit of respect that we you know that we tried to understand their language and tried to you know speak it, but we were bad at it. <laughs> I'll gotta admit we were bad. What the heck was that? Did you actually see something flash by there? Great. Just great. Well, at least I got something out of it. A chest of high potion. Uh, uh, is there someone here? What the heck? Fishies! Big ones of that. Well, it looks like it's battle time. Time to fight! <laughs> well, kill one right off the bat. Here's the second one. <laughs> what are you looking at? What the? Oh, don't tell me there's more monsters coming. Crap, that's a big fella. Well, he's dead. Oh, great. 
Now we got a big problem. Looks like it's boss fight time. Yep, it's a boss. Ooh, ow, that hurt. Okay, this thing's doing some serious damage. I might get rid of one more, then I might have to use my heal. Uh-oh. Think I've made him angry. Yep, I think I've pissed him off. <laughs> oh. Oh, great. Now I've really pissed him off. Yeah, I agree. Swim for it. <clears throat> ah, an exit. Swim for it, boy. Swim. Swim like there's a blood fester on your tail. Oh, oh. You got lucky. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. My throat is still sore. So I got jettisoned out of that tunnel. Well, how do it out of the frying pan and into the freezer? <laughs> That's true. <coughs> I thought I was gonna die in this place. Anyway, back to what I was saying about Japan. I mean, in many languages, you can understand a bit of a broken language, which is. You know, it's not perfect, but you can get, like, the basic, you know, gist of things. I mean, it's been a kind of understood that. To an extent, but to be honest, it was very, very hard. <laughs> hey, it looks like this used to be a temple of some sort. Well, of course, there's lots of water. Need fire. <sighs> right? So, let's look around. So, I gotta look for something that's made for Tinder. Can we use these? Yep. Can't be served as Tinder. Right. The best course of action, guys, is to save when you can. Trust me on this, this game could quickly turn on its head in a quick hurry. So do save up. Examine. Yeah, yeah, I'll examine. Yeah. Heyo, what are those? Flint. Well, that's good. So that means we've got something to make a light. This is all classic, you know, Boy Scout kind of thing. Well, I'm hoping I didn't offend anyone worth saying that, but it's all Scout tricks. Is this probably back in the wall? Yeah, it's put it in that chamber. Nope, I don't want to be there. It's classic, you know, Scout training where you use um, flint and then some form of, like, wood or grass or you know, something as a tinder. It's, I mean, I used to be, I used to do scouts when I was younger, and, oh, there it is. Can we use these? Yep, yeah, with a bouquet. Yep, yeah, you use things like that, like dried up leaves and all that as tinder. With, with some wood to try, you know, catch the fire. Is there anything up here just to, oh, a chest. Hi, potion again. Well, I'm going to probably need it eventually, but I was hoping for something a little more robust. Like, I don't know, a, a holy or remind or something like that to give it a stat effects. A little more robust. Right. So, as you can see, we have some wood. We put the tinder on, which is the, um, the bouquet, and then we try and heat it. Although it does not go boom like that. 
normally when it comes to these kind of fires with campfires, it takes a while. You have to blow on it to get some, you know, flames going. <clears throat> uh, oh, great. Now what? <clears throat> I wouldn't light still too long. There's something around here. And I don't think it's friendly. I need food. Christ's sake, man. First you were cold, then scared, now you want food? What do you Jeez. want? It was a bad call. Your team lost because of you. You came to say that? <laughs> it's been ten years. I thought you'd be crying. Who? Me? <laughs> you cry. <laughs> What's the deal with that kid, anyway? <clears throat> right. Tyler did the worst thing... What was that? Right. First rule of campfire, guys: never leave a fire unattended. Wait, wait! Uh, don't go out on me. Uh, nah, just hold on. I'll get more wood. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna be happening because of him. Now, I'm gonna be honest, guys. Ty's made the biggest mistake in a campfire. You never leave a campfire unattended. Even if you're tired, never leave it unattended. Or you could start a massive fire, hurt yourself, or it will go out. You've got to always maintain it. That's the first rule of maintaining a campfire. So don't say this channel has not taught you a few things. Straight up slugfest by the looks of it. Bad, not bad. Right. Um. No. I don't want to use high potion. Nope. I'll use normal potion. High potion's good, but I want to avoid using that as much as possible. This is going to get to a stalemate, this. What the hell? Um, okay. Looks like I either got backup or they're after me. And that's a lot of guns. Looks like the leader wants to get in his action. Yep, it's battle time. Cool. Don't get using grenades. Certain items like grenades have a special effects when used. So this is basically this character's special ability. Now this is a thief character. In Final Fantasy, there's always you know different you know characters like class types. This one is the thief. And I forgot to mention, guys, if I recall, in Final Fantasy X, this was the last game, I believe that had a bit of the class system you know of what class they were so this one is mostly the thief so because anyone has steel is the automatic thief class grenade all right let it rip <laughs> that did some damage and titus is i don't know what what you could call him he's not a warrior well he is a warrior but he's not like like Orin. how Orin's like a big like warrior class I would say he was more like a striker. Ooh, that was good. Use grenade. Oh, that did some damage. That's a oop, dodged. And that. You're very slow, pal. And he's dead. Ah, 
Got my first level. Nice. Ability Spears. Right, this will come into effect a little bit later once we get a chance to use them, but we can't at the moment. Quite the revealing outfit, I gotta admit. Not much luck. Frederick Drek! The fiend, here is a Tekiaka! Fuck, it a coup! Gammed? Yeah, Jesus! Frederick Rissar! Drown me a Drakisha tail! If one petted, but one naked Frederick! Um, okay, I don't understand what the hell you're saying there, pal. Ooh. Right in the gut. <clears throat> yep. The language you saw in the circle, that's their language. <clears throat> Whoever they are. Well, looks like I'm screwed again. <laughs> 